guys, if you look here, we're actually at the old uh, Hardman and Kane fencing company, and I've met up with a with a chap called Sean, who's going to give us a little tour and hopefully tell us a bit of history about the old place. <laughs> yeah, because apparently this uh, this old fencing company, guys was once Stott's Pit before becoming a, uh, a brickyard. So there's a lot of history here and I believe these two buildings right here were actually, have actually been here since that pit. I think it closed in uh, 1936, wasn't it Ian? 34. When the, f 34 was it, yeah. So yeah, there's a lot of history in this old place, guys. And uh, I think, are these getting pulled soon? Yeah. Are they getting pulled, these buildings? Yeah. Are they, yeah? yeah? Yeah, so it looks like we're gonna be the last ones, guys, to ever actually see them. You can see my mate Rick here from the, uh, what video was it, mate? Ridgely, Ridgely wasn't it? Oh wow. Can I film some of these mate? Yeah. That's the oceans on there, Rick. Right. The all these I've got now. Wow. 1936 is coal picking. Yeah. It's Looks like, like one of the slag heaps, isn't it? Yeah. Get out. That's it, I should have one of them. Yeah, it will be, won't it? So literally that's the road that's that leads down, here. isn't it? And there's all the cobbles. Yeah. Wow. That were manager's house and under the manager's house. That is cool. Very it's cool. The uh, way bridge here. Yeah. But we ain't calling it out. Because the tracks would have come into bed at one point as well off the railway, wouldn't they? Well there was down the side. That is oh area. wow, look at that. Yeah, there we go from above. Is that building still there? Yeah. Wow. So when did the brick place shut down that it became? Couldn't tell you. No. You can see there guys, that's when they were doing the fencing. But pretty much we're on the remnants of the last pit of shutting West Orton, wasn't it really? That was on the... On that oh station. wow, look at that. That's all on that building. That is cool. I did a place in uh, Agecroft, did you see the Agecroft power station video I did? Yeah. And they had these up. I saw, I, we can't take things when we go in, obviously we won't, but I so wish I did. That's proper cool, that is. So that's original, that as well. Mint. Well, that, that is West Orton, like, in the early 60s. Yep. There's White Lion. Oh, wow, yeah. We're thinking of doing the White Lion soon, guys. There's a little... Uh... So where's this oh, place? This is, oh, it's further up here. Is it, right? Just out of shot line. Rick, oh, yeah, there's the cemetery. Oh, there's the old church, Rick. Look at that. Yeah. Girl, those are right. Yeah, because like, yeah, we're doing that church soon. We're I doing the up, tower and that. I grew up here. No way. That's the old empire. Where? It's the girl. Huh. Where is that, bro? It's that, That is mad, that is. That's the old vicarage. That's all gone. All this is gone. It's all, all changing, this. isn't it? There's no police station. I love them old aerial shots. It's mad how rapidly a heavier can change. We fished that as a kid. <laughs> per Percy's Pond. Is it still there, that, do you reckon? No, they built all around it. Well, they didn't build on the pond. Right. Then, 15 or 20 years later, it was somebody's garden and they built yeah. on it now. No way, man. That's still a, that's where fur used to go. Yeah, yeah. Mill Street. Well, this is where all of these were cross guns. Is that a mill? That's like a big mill. That's a mill, that's where the old is now. No way. That's Library Street. The library. Because right. West Hart was one of the. It was possibly one of the towns that had the most pits in in the Lancashire coalfield, wasn't it really? <laughs> I think there were about 25, 26 pits here back in the day. Alright, if you look here guys, 
Sean's just uh, brought us in here with that. I don't know if you can make that out, if I can zoom it in for you. It says RN Gun Factory, West Horton. I don't know if you can see that. In fact, let me flick to my iPhone a second. One second. Oh, there we go. That's well better, that. Let me see if we can... There we go. Look. RN Gun Factory, West Horton. And if we flick it over, number 18... What is this, like a commemorative coin or just something? Maybe it's a... No clue. It looks like it could have been on a chain. Maybe it's a clock of ink coin or something. Yeah, there. if you look at the old there though, it could have been on a chain or something. Cool. Yeah, but just round the corner where we are, guys, you can actually see the the gates that still stand for this old factory if you, if you Google it. Cool, man. If you look there, guys. Oh, so this is from before you moved. All oh, right, this is. Uh... They had a place in Wigan Road, and they owned this place. They had wow. stocks. How old is this then? Oh wow, look at that! Nineteen thirty-five. That dates back from. No way. I mean, even that is uh, nineteen forty. Haulage contractor. Wow. Oh that's wow. That's yeah. Public Weybridge, Church Street. That's that's this place. Right. So you would have come in on the cobbles, and it would have been. <clears throat> yeah. Matthew Charles Walker, Leslie Walker, and Marion Haywood. Wow. Can I put that up close to the camera, mate? Just have a little. Let them all have a look at that. Look at that, guys. You can just. It's got that like wartimey old school look on it, hasn't it? How old do you reckon this is then? 30s, 40s? Is it 40? Yeah. Dated there on top, yeah. No, there's no date on this one. No. Yeah, it's got to be 40s, that though, hasn't it? Survive That's pretty cool, that, in here. That's pretty cool, man. I'm so glad we've got to see them. So, what is this? Is this like an old book of, from the brickworks itself? No, book? this was down, stuff they were selling. All ah, right, okay. They're selling seven and stuff in here. Yeah. Hulton Colliery Ashes. Wow. Threatens per load. Man, I was up there the other day, literally. Threatens per load. Look at that there, 19th. What's it say there? Account faulty. <laughs> oh, fuller. Settled. Ah, March right, yeah. 34. 1934. Shuttle Street Tilsley. William Whitworth. Wow. Bill Wembert. So it's just an account of people's accounts, really, isn't it? Yeah, if you look at that there, guys, that is that. When's this one dated to? This one will be nineteen thirty-five. Look at that, guys, nineteen thirty-five, and that is G and J Seddon's, which is still going to yeah, this very old. day. There we go, Little Alton. Mint. If you look at that, guys, you can actually uh, see the outside of the book there. That is legitimate ancient history. That is unbelievable. Look at that. MC Walker. Flip it over and look at that. Unreal. Proper bit of history, that is. But yeah, I know it's a bit I know it's a bit different this one guys, but I just wanted to show you because we've got to have some kind of record of it. It's industrial heritage in it, you know, and it's just gonna it's just gonna end up being erased from history. But the cobbles we were telling you about are these ones here. And as you can see, they've literally been there since the early 1900s. I mean I wonder when this pit was actually opened then. Really? I'm not. Do you know when it? Do you know it when it would open this pit? I don't know. No. But it's still full of coal. Is it? It got flooded. Yeah, I read that. This and Pretoria, wasn't it? Well, asphalt pit off the Lane. Yeah. Still got all the pump buildings there. Yeah. It's uh, 
he come to the manager and said, if you keep paying us, we'll keep the pumps going. And he wouldn't pay. He said, well, not get flooded. Then they got flooded. Yeah. They tried everything to get rid of the coal, but they couldn't. Yeah. <laughs> get rid of the this little building here, was that part of the... No. Was it not? There's been two staircases. That little one up there. Oh, right, yeah, it's a side door. It's side built there. That were a window upstairs that we two kids. Right, all right. So a window like this side. Yeah. Was. So was Admin and Kane your company then? Yeah. Because yeah. I used to come here to get fencing for a lad called John at Newbrook Gardening. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. used to work for him. So what would this have been here then? Like a, just a, a window or? Yeah, them at windows. Yeah. Them at windows. When I come, just a big pearl wooden door. Right, all right. So this has been here since the late 1800s, hasn't it? Yeah. Easy. Unreal. I don't believe I've not got my torch. Oh, oh Rick, I've not got my torch. Do you mind if I just grab my torch, mate? Oh, we've got lights. I think we've got lights. And we're not holding the lights upstairs. Oh, there we go. There we go. No, I think it's. I think we'll be all right. I'm looking in camera there, and it looks pretty light, doesn't it? Wow. This is proper old school, isn't it? Do you mind if we have a scan about, mate? Even that there, that old window. Look at that, guys. I hope it's bright enough for you in the camera. I bet there's all sorts of remnants of the mining days in here just hidden away what you wouldn't even wouldn't even realise. So would these have just been normal windows then? Yeah. That is so they cool. Can still see the of the window, but yeah, yeah, I can see it over back actually. Wow. So what would they use this for? Upstairs they use it for dancing in the bar. Ah, right. World War II. On some old maps, it says that this, this was a sawmill, but I don't know why. Mm. So, yeah. I'd, I'd have thought they'd have had coal stored in here and all that lot or something, I don't know. You can literally tell the age of it, guys, just by the smell of this place. Is that an extension? Yeah, we On that, that. right, all so, right, yeah. Uh, yeah, well. All this, guys, is uh, going to be nothing but uh, an echo of the past soon. What's happening here? Are they building on the site? Or, yeah. yeah. What have you sold it on like? And then they're going to build houses, is it? Yeah, do Am I all right to have a look upstairs, yeah, mate? Yeah. I don't think you might need light up there. Uh, I might just grab it if it's too dark. If it'll only be two seconds. Hey, up. Now, they are a bit rickety. Wow. Yeah, we're going to need the torch, Rick. <laughs> Go on, I'll grab it, mate. I'll grab it. It's a sick car, isn't it? Sorted. Yeah, so we're going to have a little uh, mooch up here now and see what literally remains up top. Oh, wow, these stairs are going to be a guys. <laughs> ah, they. Wow. So, yeah. It's a very, very old building, this. You can tell just by the bloody floors. <laughs> but um, I wanted to come in here and record it because obviously I don't know if you've followed army videos, whoever is watching now, but we've done quite a few things with regards to the Lancashire coal field, and we're going to be doing many more. Um, looking up at the ceiling there if you look up top guys you can actually see i don't know if you can see that little round ball that is a, actually a massive wasp's nest absolute monster i want it is so yeah i'm a bit wary of uh, going past that but we'll have a little we'll have a little mooch because there's something down in this bottom corner I want to look at. Oh, it's just old, old photographs, but you can see where they've been cutting up all the, uh, all the fencing up here over the years when it was a, when it was a fencing company, you know. Um, but 
pretty much this has been here guys since the late 1800s when it was once a part of Stott's pit so even though it's only going to be a little short video um, I'm glad that we have been able to record it really there's a thing up there it says I wouldn't say I'm the best panel maker in England but I'd be in the top one and if you look up there there's an old bit of writing that's been carved out and it looks like it's an old English style font it says Pete and Jeff and I believe possibly Phil but yeah just looking up there you can tell how old this gaff is and soon enough it'll no longer be here so I'm happy I can say I've uh, covered quite literally the final remnant of the old Stotts pit which I think that's pretty cool to be honest with you not a lot of people could say the same I mean you can smell the age in here guys but yeah pretty much it were a brick merchants brick 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 makers I believe after uh, after they filled in the pits then it became the fencing company and now it's gonna uh, fade into history I mean if you look where the old all the old light fittings were and that I don't know like and all these have been put up decades later but they still instill that wartimey vibe man you know it proper suits the the environment that we're in and uh, yeah i can feel it just just the history you can actually feel it standing here you know it's proper cool i really do love doing what we do sweet oh by the way there is a humongous wasp nest in your attic thing up there really? it's on the ceiling it's about that big really right in the middle of the ceiling i went up i went we'll go down that <laughs> is this another building then from that's the pits that's substation. right okay that's where that sign comes oh door. is it right it was on here <clears throat> so this was what we're pretty much feeding power where it could back in the day then you can see the outside there. I think you have put this on, haven't you? After. Yeah. Well, that's there's a doorway up corner there. But right. All oh, right, that led underneath, kind of. But led into a workshop. Ah, right. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I see where it's bricked up. Yeah. Yeah, just a little, uh, like a little outhouse thing where they could store wood and that. And that's that. You would have been out of getting that door back in the day as well. But yeah, apparently, guys, this building here is the old Stotts Pit substation. Even this is going then, is it? Yeah. That's a staircase. A staircase either side. Oh, yeah, outer staircase. Do you know what? I'm sure I've seen this building on an old picture then. Hmm. On an old black and white photograph I was yeah, looking at. Yeah. There are two yeah. toilets, one on each side. Probably male and female toilets. Oh no way. Are they open them? Can you get in them? No. We we made them, them weren't there we Oh have you put them on, yeah, right, alright. Two little quirky there's, there's toilets there. Toilet you can still see. Yeah. So pretty much running along the back here <coughs> was the train line. Oh well, it's still there. Yeah. Sidings. So so they used to offload on this side then, do you reckon? Yeah, a bit further down. Is it? Hopefully, I'm going to try and have a look. If, if, if I end the video and I haven't done, then you know I couldn't get in. But as you can see, Rick is uh, a bit of an invalid at the minute, aren't you, mate? <laughs> All I'm going to say is it was a sheep that caused it, guys. So I'll let you uh, ponder what actually happened. <laughs> Sorry, brother. Oh, wow, yeah. 
it's going to be a lot of isn't it? There we go. Wouldn't go in here. What, they reckon it was haunted? Yeah, yeah. Well, we shall see. Apparently there's a few... A few lads who wouldn't go in here, guys. But I'll just show you, because you like getting up close to the grime. We've got plenty of cobwebs in this old gaff. So let's see. Uh, oh, this, oh wow, yeah, I can tell. There we go, guys, so you can see the original door there. I mean, when you're in here, you can smell it. You can almost imagine seeing old miners knocking about and that, you know, with a little lanterns and whatnot. Wow. Oh, there we go, this has got lights. And there you go. Like, there's not really much left of the mining days, but you can still feel the age of the room, can't you, you know? I mean, there's little remnants like that up there. I don't know what that would have been connected to. If any of you can tell us what that would have been. But yeah, this is uh, pretty much the last remnant that's going to remain of Stott's pit. So we're pretty lucky to get in here really. And film it before it's gone. I'm hoping to get some some transitions and we can transition. What is it, sorry? Oh wow, yeah. Got the old electric shock sign there. If you look. There we go. Artificial respiration, mouth to mouth method. There's all bits and bats what have been stored here as well. Don't think that's anything uh, we want to be looking at, but if you look here, for all the lads watching, if you've had a few beers, there we go. Nice pair of titties for you. <laughs> We've always got to throw one of them in every now and then, here. I mean, it makes a change from all the knobs we've seen dotted oh, about yeah, on the walls, boy. doesn't it? <laughs> Yeah, pretty much, guys. Uh, I mean, I know it's not much to see, but if you think about the history here and all the places that we've covered over the years and the many more that we're going to cover, um, I think it's a, a pretty important part, step in that little journey, isn't it, you know? Yeah, I mean, you coming here and without no light, guys, it's absolutely pitch black darkness. So I can see why some of the lads would have come in here and got... A, Got some creepy vibes. I'm not getting creepy vibes on. No, not at all, but if you just look there. Yeah, you can, I don't know. You can actually feel it when you're in here, you know. You can feel the age, so. I'm so glad we've got to, uh, to come and have a little mooch. I'll show you the outside of this building, though, before it's gone for good. I mean, just look at the slates on the roof, man. Proper old school. And I know it doesn't seem much, but for those who are interested in mining and whatnot, then it'd be a pretty cool, pretty cool little find for you. See some old bricks here. I wonder if they were actually made here when it were the brickworks. Yeah, and it's just the back of the building there. What was the brickworks called? Oh, I forget the name of it. I had it in the head as well. Hall. Nah, it was two names, two names, I forget now. Yeah, I forget. I was wondering whether any of them could have been actually made here. You never know, do you? Well, the first world war, these make uh, gun barrels and that there. Harlan Rogers. Harlan Rogers, that's the one, yeah, Harlan Rogers, guys. What, they used to make them here? No, uh, no, on, on industrial estate. Ah, like right, okay. Oh, yeah, you showed me, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, the old thing. But yeah, I think uh, we'll give you one last look at this building here. And then we'll pan down onto the road and set the route out that quite possibly most of the miners would have took back in the day. And I think that is uh, where we'll call it. Pretty much it's the last you'll ever see. Stops pit.
nice one for watching and uh, we'll see you in the next one take it easy guys peace What's up with you? What's all the noise? <laughs> Some razors, mate. There we go. We got you. We got you. Oh, right behind the ear. That's the one, isn't it, eh? There we go.